paying attention will have you realize that you are often in a much more favored position than you currently imagine yourself to be. Hi, I'm HC, and in this video, we are going to discuss the four steps of how to be more grateful. So, why is knowing how to be more grateful important? It often takes shocking moments of panic for us to realize what we have and how much we actually appreciate those things. Unfortunately, in some situations, these perturbing events end with us losing those things, at least partially, for us to recognize that they should have been cherished. And even so, when we don't lose it all, we often end up going back to being nonchalant towards them once the panic subsides, leading us to taking those very things for granted again. This nonchalance ultimately leads us to being unappreciative towards the essence of life itself, because we don't even realize that we've been blessed to have it. Ungratefulness forms neglect, neglect leads to decay, and then it won't be long until those very things are gone away. In contrast, being more grateful embellishes what you have and encourages more to come your way because of how you treat the things already in your life. Showing gratitude encourages healthier relationships as well as the flow of positive energy towards you and from you. Gratitude also enhances empathy and reduces aggression. Key elements to building strong bonds and living a fulfilled life. This is why knowing how to be more grateful is such an important factor on the journey of you becoming your best you. So, without further ado, here are the steps on how to be more grateful. Step 1. Pay attention. It is always easy to take things for granted. On the route to becoming the best version of ourselves, there are times when our overambition clouds that reality having us forget that there was a time when we wished for everything we currently have. Take a moment of your attention to notice the reality of your current life. Think of your health, which could be much worse. Think of your living situation, which could also be much worse, or ultimately non-existent. Think of your ability to share this moment with us online today through the help of your electronic device and a Wi-Fi connection, which is already much more than many will live to witness. Paying attention will have you realize that you are often in a much more favored position than you currently imagine yourself to be. This attention is essential to becoming more grateful and appreciative of the little things that keep you going every day. Step 2. Share moments of respect. With respect comes admiration and appreciation. Respect the time, the energy, and the effort that it took for you to get where you are right now. Express your respect to the people that believe in you and the people that put efforts towards helping you become the person that you are today. It is essential to understand that no one person truly owes you anything, and anything provided as sustenance to becoming the best version of you should be cherished. Respect that there are people that speak highly of you when you are not around, and even without your knowledge, are in your corner rooting for you. This respect for others becomes admiration and encourages gratitude for your life today and how far you have come. Step 3. Take care of what you have. Nurture them. Always remember, what you feed is bound to grow. Think of it like house plants. Upon purchase, the plants you have chosen may be the most fine looking plants and fit beautifully standing tall in your home. However, if you don't water your plants, and expose them to the right amount of sunlight, the once beautiful plants will be no more. Taking care of the things that you love will embellish them 
and encourage your gratitude towards them. How you take care of what you own will reflect in every area of your life. Because, as they say, nothing done in the dark will remain in the dark forever. Also, character is built when no one is looking. This to say that the things that you do to protect and take care of yourself and the things that you cherish will become evident and reflect in your life because they will reciprocally nourish your life in other areas too. Being grateful will enhance your character as well as the people and things that you hold dear to you. Never consciously take advantage of your blessings. Always remember, for everything that you love and don't take care of, there is someone alive that will and would in a heartbeat. Step 4. Be Humble Humility is the respect for life itself. Being humble will lead you to being more grateful for the people already in your life and for those that have not yet made their way. Humility is also the understanding and the appreciation that everything you have today could be gone tomorrow. The understanding that a change of fate could happen with a simple loss of focus. Thus, leading you to be more grateful for those very things when they are present in your life. Humility is the understanding that even the richest amongst men cannot buy tomorrow and are living today just as you are. Being humble will help you become more grateful because it is the acceptance of everything that you are now, yet the awareness that there is much more greatness to come. Furthermore, a humble person is patient and slow to be tempered with the imperfections or inadequacies of others or situations. Humility is the awareness that missteps and inadequacies are a part of life. This understanding leads to being grateful of all the little things and the much greater things that we come across on our journey because it is an open-mindedness when problems appear and failures happen. Always practice humility. So that's it, people. Those are the four steps on how to be more grateful and to start moving forward on your journey today. Post a comment below and let people know how being more grateful has helped you be more successful in your own right. Like and share this video. And remember to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. It really helps this channel grow. I will see you here next time on Howell Consultations, the how-to to being true to you.